You're a Chicago win until Chicago ends. ends. Absolutely. Are you from Chicago? No, 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 but I love people from Chicago. Okay, because you said that with such conviction. I felt it in my heart. Oh, I, man, I wish. I love this city. It's a great city. So now, you know, a story a lot of people can relate to. People out there trying to pursue their dreams, trying to make it happen while on the daily grind. What were some? What was your experience like filming this season? How did you enjoy the experience? It was amazing. I mean, it, it was also it was just amazing to be home, number one. I love Chicago. It's such a great city. Um, but just to see how excited people were to have a comedy filmed in Chicago and about Chicago, because we have such wonderful and deep dramas, but I think people from the city wanted to see a funny side of us, because we are, people from Chicago are hilarious. Everyone thinks they're the funniest person in the world. So just to see, and we like filmed in the community, and just to see people coming out and being like, hey! Like, it was really great. Still keeping it light. It's a comedy series, and like you said, there are a lot of serious uh, shows that come out of Chicago. Do you feel like you have to carry this uh, this torch for Chicago? Like, there's more depth to us than just all of the other stories that you've been currently seeing? Yeah. I think just for sure, just like being a Chicagoan, you you need to get the story right, you know, like, or you want to. So there's definitely, you know, a bit of that burden on the shoulders of just wanting to make the city proud and, you know, make people look at it and be like, I see myself, I see my stories. I asked Diallo what was some of his favorite parts of filming this season. He told me a story about a bus driver who just ended up in the show because he was so funny. What were some of your favorite parts? Um, so there was, actually when we were filming the sizzle reel, um, I play a cop, so I was, you know, in a scene in my uniform. And there was a girl who came up with, because she does like, um, not community policing, but like community activism. And she thought some stuff was going down, like somebody was getting abused. And this girl, and it was definitely, she was like in her early 20s, but she was... Ooh, she was strong and she rolled up and was like, excuse me, is there a problem? Like to handle the situation and dissipate everything. And I just I just love that, you know. Part of the best part about being at home is getting ready getting able to uh, take in all the good food and all the culture in the city of Chicago. So I asked him where the best food, he said uh, Illuminati's, Illuminati's, Illuminati's. Yeah, Lou Malnati's pizza, yeah, 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 yeah. Where is your favorite I'm place to eat? Salsa. I like Italian fiesta pizza, but we could fight all day. Um, my favorite place, it's probably Harold's Chicken. I know that's so typical. There's nothing wrong with that. I just love that chicken. I know. And so lastly, for everybody who's tuning in, what do you want them to think about as they head in and look at the South Side and this uh, much needed comedic portrayal of the city that's been absent so far? I just want them to know that Chicago is a wonderful city. Um, it is a city with difficulties, but we are a city of resilient, magical people who get up and face everything every day, and we laugh while doing it. I want people to see the city that I grew up in that I love. Thank you so much.